Well, welcome to the Lazy Daisy Farm, y'all. I'm glad you came. Well, thank you. So, we are here in Trimble County. Mary Beth Moon and I have traveled all the way to Trimble County, which I live here. Mary Beth across the river comes see this. And we're at the wedding barn. So, this is an awesome idea. This is awesome. tobacco bar. <laughs> and it's incredible. It's it is. so Beautiful. shabby cheap. It's awesome. We loved it. I sent pictures to my friend Sharla and I said, what do you think? And she's an interior designer. She's an interior designer. She said, I love it. Yeah. So we're, we've been working hard and getting it up and going. So we're excited to have weddings this yes, year. We and we they are, are up and going and it yes, looks beautiful are. on the inside. Yes, so exciting to show everybody what's well, let's go inside take a look. Right. Let's go. Let's go. go. Well, hi. Welcome back inside our barn. Excited to have you here in the Lazy Daisy Farm Wedding Barn. This is gorgeous. Thank you. So thank unique. You. Love how shabby chic. Oh, thank you. We worked really hard to get it all up and going and then a great friend of ours, Charla, came last night and we worked all day and all evening making sure everything would be just perfect for you all to see today. And now, how did you find this place? I know you're not from here, Correct. but your husband, has his mother lived here a long time ago. Yes, yes, she did. So she grew up here in, in Milton, Yes, and uh, we came with his job. So I uh, thought uh, this would be the perfect opportunity, and we're farmers, farm kids, right. so we had to have a space for the horses. <laughs> the <laughs> horses are awesome. They are. So they are so nice. But So we found this place, and it had this tobacco barn and just decided that this would be an awesome place to have weddings. So. Oh, wow. It is and, and you've settled in quite nicely. Mm -hmm. The you. horses, just the aesthetics of the panoramic view are beautiful. Thank you. It is a really pretty farm. We're thankful and we have wonderful neighbors so we're just thankful to have this place and be able to do this. Oh, so I, I think it's an awesome addition to Trimble County. Thank you. You know it's, it's Trimble County um, enjoys having new things come in and, and things for people to do. And this is one that people from Louisville can come to, Cincinnati, Indianapolis. Sure. It's not far away. No, uh, it's just in Bedford, Carrollton, right. all those little communities like that too, I think will benefit. So we wanted to offer an affordable uh, wedding venue right. for young people in this county. And oh, we're excited. Our oldest daughter just got married last year. So we know how expensive <laughs> weddings can get. That's so we, we, true. The That's cake true. can take up all of your <laughs> budget. <laughs> it can. So and so many venues are becoming so competitive that yes. you wonder which one best suits you. But right. this one is so unique. If it, you like rustic charm, I'm sorry. If you like rustic charm, then this is the spot. So yeah. Well, you can so. you can decorate this up, and you can make it very fancy. Mm -hmm. It doesn't have to be just farm or country. Right. You could change it with just a little decoration. Right. So. I think we achieved that last night with the yes. more elegant touch of uh, decorations. We wanted to show its versatility. Yes. So. And there is, there's so many endless yeah. possibilities, whether you want to be on the outside of the property or the inside of the property. I think that she's really on to something over here. No, oh, thank you. Thank you. I, I tell you, a lot of the people that are going to be coming to your open house will probably send more people back once they see all of this. Oh, good. And your, your open so. house is what day? April 23rd from 3 to 7.30 p.m. Right. There will be a, just a few select vendors here, all wedding oriented, so it'll help the gals see what's available in the area and we'll have appetizers and lemonade and things oh. like that so it'll just be fun this sounds like a wonderful yes. time really good time so, so and then you're going to put this out and it's going to be in the newspapers yes it's coming out come. around about madison the trimble county banner and like us on facebook at the wedding barn at the lazy daisy farm <laughs> a lot of people are seeing us there so we're right. excited to have those opportunities and, as well. And other venues we were discussing that you could have here, you know, bands could come out. Yes. Oh, yeah. Fall, lots of seasonal things to do mm -hmm. over here because she has lots of draws. Pumpkin and, cutting, you know. Yes, family pictures. Come out, take family pictures in the barn or with right. the horses, or antique tractors. 
Yeah, oh. things like that. So uh, lots of opportunities. High school graduation parties. Oh my, nice. seniors love to have their pictures mm -hmm. taken in barns and antique mm -hmm. tractors, horses. Oh, that's oh absolutely. Awesome. And she has the sweetest accommodation for brides. I think some of the time when you get married, you're like, where am I going to get ready? Where am I going to get prepared? And right. her little details of the, the bride boutique and, and the little uh, bar across right. from each other are so <laughs> perfect. <laughs> I thought the guys needed a place that's to hang right. out while the girls are getting dressed. Well, perfect. <laughs> and so we uh, we like the bar area for that. The guys can hang out over there. And there's still a mirror over there because, you know, guys want to look good too. Occasionally so. they do. <laughs> <laughs> so they can print as well. So. And there's also an area where you can take photos after the wedding. Mm -hmm. You've got it all set the up. photo booth area. Yeah. And it's it's very attractive. Thank I just, you. I think it's really cute with the bench there and all the flowers and pillows. And well, thank you. It's really nice. We have some uh, nice things coming for next year. Um, we're going to build park-like restrooms next year. Yes. One whole side of the barn is going to have a full porch on it. Um, an arch is coming this year. We have a couple girls getting married already that have signed up for weddings and they're getting married under an arch. So we've got a lot of exciting things that are coming as well. Oh, wow. That's so exciting. So neat for Milton Aww. and for you. A yes. personal experience that has um, nostalgic for you being that it was your mother-in-law's farm. Yeah. So yeah. that is, that's great. Dream come true. Oh, wow. Well, you know, and the thing of that is, too, we're going to meet all these people, mm -hmm. and they're going to come back, and they're going to send people back. So you're going to end up with all kinds of friends that you didn't realize you could have. That's I think that's <laughs> the neatest part. When I meet people, yeah. they're always a friend. I never yeah. have always keep in touch and I think that's mm -hmm. a really neat thing to do. A couple of the brides are texting me and telling me their their dress has been found or hey what do you think look about this, this? and oh, look at this. Cool. I love that. I love that. So I love that they're contacting me and making me a part of that with right. them. It's exciting and it's fun. And I feel neat. like they're welcoming me into their lives you yes. know not just as a place to get married but as a friend. And they always appreciate that outside mm -hmm. help because sometimes yeah. you know um, I hate to say this, but sometimes a family member will try to pressure the bride into wearing what yes. she wants them to wear. It can become overwhelming. Yes. So this, can this bride can definitely have her own mm -hmm. forte in planning her yes. own wedding. Yes. And, and Kelly can help personalize those touches. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, absolutely. And I think I have a decent eye for things, but I'm so thankful definitely. for our friend, Charlo, who has a great eye for those things. It's nice to have resources that yes. you can draw from yes. because I can't do it all. And so I'm so glad to have resources and so many good friends and people around the area that are willing to help out. So, And, and this setting here, you can get things from Oldham County, you mm -hmm. can get things from Carrollton, from in, from Madison. So you have a really yes. large draw there. Oh, absolutely. All kinds of resources. And if people are coming from out of town, there are so many cute places to stay in Madison. Yes. You know, there's and boutiques. Yes, boutiques too. <laughs> yeah, boutiques. And Taurus. <laughs> so basically at Lazy Daisy, over here at Lazy Daisy Farms, Kelly can set you up for, I mean, really the whole venue. She's yes. going to have all those extra uh, contacts of who right. she can be one-stop shopping with, which is That's very right. important a company, for a ride. A company dinner or a company, you know, if they're having a, a banquet of some time, a retirement banquet, or yes. it doesn't have to be a wedding. This can be anything, you know, like we said, a band earlier. Right. Sure. You know, whatever you want to do. A boot scoot boogie night. I oh, see that for a weekend. <laughs> I mean, we're all, you know, cowboy people. Yeah. And yeah. that would be great for we're over here. We're going to have a family barn dance down here in July. So there's wow. one weekend in July. We're not booking weddings. The third weekend. And we're just having the whole family come down. Perfect. And have a, a barn dance night. So it'll be a lot. That'll be your celebration That'll for getting all this started. Absolutely. Absolutely. Oh, well, this so, well you're off to a wonderful beginning. Oh, thank you so much. We're so glad you let us come down and see this and, well, and show us what wonderful things you've done with this barn. Thank this you. This is wonderful. I'm honored that you're here. Thanks so much for featuring us. We appreciate it. Well, we do. I'm going to tell you, we appreciate what you do. We love doing <laughs> we stuff like yeah. this. And it's just knowing that we have these amenities in our community. Uh, Debbie from Kentucky, me from across the bridge. Mm -hmm. I mean, it's just great that we all can come together. And, oh, and that's absolutely. what we do. We co-brand with each other mm -hmm. and help each other out. So I, I think that's the success of any business is that you 
attach yourself to other businesses mm -hmm. and yeah. then you help each other out. I if see you, it as a partnership, don't yes, you? Yes, mm -hmm. it has to be. If yeah. you try to do it all on your own, yeah. I, I don't see anybody being very successful when right. they do that. No, right. I don't either. And you know, when, and when things are slow, somebody else may have another opportunity mm -hmm. and like coming together, you create opportunities yes. together. Yes, exactly. So it helps everyone. Yeah, yeah, exactly. You know, if we're booked on a date, I'd like to know someone who isn't booked for that date and be able to refer people to yes. their venue. Yes. So awesome. that's exciting. Yes. I'd like to be able to do that. Oh, so. wow. Well, I'm sure once we get all this out, there'll be people contacting you about the, mm -hmm. the barn and yeah. if you want to refer them to their barn or sure. <laughs> it's, it's, it's It'll be something that will be picked up quickly and yes. people will mm -hmm. spread the word. It, it's really picked up just on Facebook. So now, um, how many did you say were coming the day of the open house there, already? There are 80 interested and 20 committed to coming. So there's 100 people that are interested in coming, and I'm excited about that. Sure. So we're going to have uh, my daughter and my friend and some folks here to help book those dates on a common calendar. And uh -huh. so we're asking people to uh, bring a deposit to hold their date. And yes. if they do, they'll get a discount on their wedding. Yes. So. Uh, we're just looking forward to helping people, meeting people that day, having a lot of fun, and, and enjoying having people out here. So Now, do you furnish anything? I'm sure the brides are going to ask that. You know, Tables and chairs. We clean the barn before and after, yes. haul away the trash, things like that. Um, we can seat 150 with yes. tables and chairs inside the barn on both sides. That leaves the middle open for a dance floor. Yes. Um, seating outside is completely unlimited under the arch. If you have enough hay bales, you can bring as many people as you want. <laughs> Right. Accommodate. So it really, uh, you know, can do any size wedding outside. Right. And there's plenty of farmers around to get the hay bales. And Absolutely. Then take them back when you're done so yeah. you can borrow them almost. <laughs> and Kelly even has the most gorgeous horse to put, to pose with. Yes. So yes. Yes. for these, these wonderful brides that are outdoorsy yeah. and just love that panoramic scenery, <laughs> there's so many things that you can draw from out there. Thank so you. you definitely need to take advantage of that when you're planning your photography. Oh, yeah. Yeah, absolutely. It's gorgeous. So there's a waterfall next year. We hope to, there's a waterfall in the woods. There's six acres of woods behind us. Oh. And there's a waterfall and a rock drop off. Right. And so we want to cut through and make a path back there, make it sort of a park-like setting. There's a very large flat rock back there that you can stand on with your wedding dress. Oh. And behind is this waterfall. It's just gorgeous back there. But oh. it'll be a little bushwhacking this year. Yeah. <laughs> so oh. that's a feature well, coming. Well, you know, you have, you have those plans and you have those mm -hmm. phases to your dream and it sounds like you're just sliding through. So. Absolutely. Little details too about this place is that Kelly produces like little plaques, wood plaques, and they're actually putting the names and the dates of the weddings and then being nostalgic and putting them on the wall. So that's something yeah. kind of neat to leave your imprint on this as a signature stamp for uh, the Lazy Daisy Farm Bar. It was actually a future groom who had that idea. It's perfect. I loved it. I loved it. You, you'll find a lot of new ideas when people come in. That'll be neat to draw from and to present to other brides that they're not sure what they want. Right. And you can have a, a folder there ready for them. Exactly. Yeah, exactly. So thank wow. you so much for letting us come and visit and be a part of this. I myself as having an eye for detail, I can tell you that this gets a first class stamp of rating. Tables, the ambiance of the candles, uh, decor, feathers, love feathers. <laughs> Perfect. So come out and book your wedding and see Kelly on the 23rd uh, to arrange uh, a viewing of this fantastic venue. Yeah. Well, even if, if whether it's a wedding or whether it's a business that wants to do something here, you, ne you need to be open minded and come see this place. Oh, I think it'd be great. Thank you. And the decorations, I, I certainly owe. Oh, Debt of gratitude to Sharla, my friend from Indiana, who came down and rescued me last night. She's I think Sharla's going to be here a lot. <laughs> she is going to be here a lot. <laughs> we, we, it's good to have a good friend, it isn't is. it? Yes. It is. Yes. It is. And, and I'm sure Kelly, depending on what your venue is, that she'll work with you too on your de decor and, yeah. and Absolutely. Uh, We'd love you know, to ideas that. that you have with your eclectic, whatever. They seem to be a, a, a duo here that can get it together and plan your party. So Yeah, and we know some resources now. We know too. some resources and work. That's we can good. all work together. Oh yes, yes. yes. That makes it that makes it perfect when you can work with somebody. It makes it more fun, I think. Yeah. So yes. we have a lot of fun doing that. Well, thank you so much for having us out here. We really do appreciate it. I appreciate you. Thank having. you. Thanks for coming. Thank, thank you. you. Well, make sure you make it out here at least to visit and keep an open mind. Thanks for watching.